Hey, thanks for checking in on Bathtub Sir, and welcome back to Iconoclast. With enemies at our back, we are forced into City 1. I think the aim here is to find the mother herself and hope that she'll heal our brother Elro, because he's missing like an eye and an arm, I think. He's in a terrible way, so we need some good healing. Um, it's going to be dangerous though, because they're not exactly friendly in City 1, I don't think. We don't belong. We've got the whole gang together though, which is new. Oh god, are these the gates to get in? This reminds me of the Wizard of Oz. Hopefully Royal can get us through. That dude's beard's quite impressive, though. This place is lovely. Oh, yeah, God, look, he is missing an arm and an eye. Fucking hell. <laughs> um, gate, uh, gatekeeper Progenarian Pete. Blessings of the try upon you. Oh, so he knows him, then. That's good. Open the gates for me. I must see Mother. And who are you? Oh, God, no one knows who Royal is. He's getting a bit of a, an ego puncture here. Uh, uh, it's Royal. Future medium to the almighty he. Royal has a very plain face. I recognise him by his entourage of soldier caretakers. <laughs> oh god, so despite being perhaps one of the most important people, you just blend in with everyone else, you don't stand out, Royal? I feel sorry for you, dude. You're bringing with you a mechanic, a cripple, and someone I swear looks like one of them pirates. I wouldn't mind a splicing of the main brace at this point. What the hell does that mean? I wouldn't mind a splicing of the main brace at this point. Well, that went over my head. City One is for the purest and devout, those who truly give everything to Mother, him and the stars. I know, I live here. How can you not tell who I am by my looks? Hair dye is very popular these days, and so are white clothes, at least inside City One. Oh, God. I don't understand it myself, all these young people trying to look like a creation rather than actually create something. How jaded are you, Gatekeeper Pete? Creativity is internal. What the hell are you talking about? Just let Magic Man shimmer fingers in, he misses his mother. Shut up! Okay, Gatekeeper, are you forcing me to display my power? I know who you are, Royal. Unfortunately, Mother has labelled you a sinner, and sinners do not get into City 1. Oh man, betrayed by your own mother, Royal. How does that feel? It's going terribly for us. And Elro's looking so, so bad. He looks like a John McClane, but if it's gone terribly wrong. You are always arrogant. It is a great thing to be able to tell you that now. Your current power is still not enough to open this gate on your own, and with your sins, I doubt he will ever permit them to be. All you kids are arrogant. Go somewhere else, Royal. I won't, repeat, I won't report you this time. Man, so you, he's really not fond of the millennials, I think. Poor old Pete. I have this thing here to read. Now, is he holding that book with his hands or his feet? I can't tell. Does he even have feet? Is he sitting on a toilet? I don't know. Well, you tried. You keep trying, even though there's not a single person treating you well anymore. I kind of want to believe you're genuinely sincere about helping us, in your way. I couldn't take it. If Mother hated me, I need to hear it from her. Maybe our crafty mechanic here can think of some way to put that gatekeeper in his place and get us in? Put him in his place, hmm. What could you mean, Mina? So, if we was to put the gatekeeper in his place, what, we want us to, like, mould him into the gate itself? Don't bother the birds. Are we meant to hurt him? Okay, this, this doesn't make a lot of sense to me. I, I don't want to... I don't want to, like, kill him. Is there any way... Oh, God. Oh, in his place. Does that mean we swap with this DNA gun? There we go. <laughs> nice. Thank you for the cryptic clue, Mina. Oh, that was a little door behind him. So the grand gates were just for show. A bit exactly like the Wizard of Oz. There's just a small little door behind there. Okay, cool. We're, we're in. It doesn't matter now. I'm sure Pete will be fine. Concussion, maybe. Internal bleeding at the worst. Swelling of the brain, maybe. Um, I guess we'll take the ladder. That door's definitely locked. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. It's the Moon Man. Let's get this gun out. Would he be friendly? No, no. Oh, bollocks. Okay, okay. I don't think we can hurt him. We can knock it back. No, we'll just we'll just leave him be. There you go. He can't shoot up. Oh fuck! There's more of them. Jump over like that. Want to knock the grenade back? No, that's not doing anything. We're just taking a lot of damage. Shit. We need some tweakness. Oh whoa! Look at her cool hair. Like a female Jacksepticeye. Um, let's can't get through there. Well, oh, top of the morning to you, young lady. Oh, you're a mechanic, right? Is one of the heaters not working correctly again? Why don't you guys just replace them? Jeez. Oh, she seems a little bit arrogant. Oh, look at this cool Elvis man. Hello. Where the hell is Tony? The ball pit bar opens today, and I'm not going to stand in that line alone. 
the ball pit bar? Sign me up. What's that with you? I mean, you can get drunk in a ball pit. It sounds almost like a hazard. <laughs> Getting so drunk and drowning in the ball pit. It's kind of sad. Um, this dude, he would be fine if it weren't for that facial hair. He looks like he's been like uh, shoveling loads of Simpson donuts into his mouth. He's got all this, the icing stained around his, around his face. Uh, Mother is wearing a lot of diagonal sashes now. You'd look awesome in that. I mean, I know that's the thing. I just kind of still like this though. Oh, you already look awesome. Of course you should keep wearing that if you want to. No, no, you're right. I should do it. So there's a lot of positivity here. A little bit of uh, arrogance as well, I think. But, I mean, maybe I don't think we fit in here. So maybe because it's all new. Oh, how about these guys? Is he a mechanic? Wait, he looks in a little bit of pain. Unless they're role-playing. Uh, he's the doggy and she's the master. Is that weird? It's probably weird. Four. His name's Four. Wait, should, does that name ring a bell? Like, in context of this game? I worked so hard for this. I'm finally here. It was all worth it. No more penance. Don't cry, Dad. You did it. We can live safely now. Do you need help getting up, dude? No, you're just going to repeat yourself. That's fine. When I'm exhausted, I often repeat myself. Uh, Nurse Joy, can you help us? Awesome. A girl mechanic. Hey, do you know if this shop sold all the new nebulas? They closed early, which is stupid. I really need that nebula. What's nebula? Let's save, though. This is an important place. It's actually quite tranquil. I know it's like sort of very snobbery and uh, pr probably brings out the worst in people, but I like it here. Story of me? Who's that about? And these are the same citizens. This movie was stupid. Just complete garbage. Seriously, don't see it. You want about the story of me? I want to see it. Hey, did you see this function on the new nebula? Um, should I get the new nebula, though? Everybody hated that other awful crap they did for it. Well, I need the functions. I haven't heard anything bad since it released anyway, so... I guess you're right. Oh shit, is it this year's new nebula? Has it got better fake, uh, facial recognition? Some more emojis? Okay, mechanic, seriously, open this door already. I'm going to have to walk two blocks just to get 20 meters from here. Very pushy. You're talking down to me because I'm not a City One citizen, is that right? Let's get out of here. Oh fuck, okay, one concern, bozo. Oh shit! What a weird baseball slide. I can't. Oh, that's how we hurt him, there we go. Why just jump the gun a little bit? Sweet, we've got some of our tweakness back. So it looks like everything needs to be reflected against these enemies here. Um, oh man, I'm gonna feel like I'm gonna struggle with this. Okay, oh fuck, bollocks! <laughs> Alright, let's try that again. So that moves that one. What happens if I just do that? So it'd be easier not to turn this first one at all. Oh, bollocks. Okay, okay. Oh, right. So if you jump near it, it's going to move it away. Hmm. Well, in that case, let's try this again. And I'll stay ducked for longer, perhaps. Whoa, why did I not hang on to that? Come on, Robin. You need to help me out. I'm not cut out for these puzzles. Sometimes they click, sometimes they don't. This is a case of the fingers snapping but no sound coming out. Obviously you need to drop that box down as well. That's better. All oh, right, and that's how you do it. Oh, I've done it. Okay, so it sticks in place. Um, you're probably wondering what I did. Basically, if you're struggling with this yourself, when you get round to that cog there, you do the spin attack and hold it until it locks into place, and that'll keep it there. And if you get up, you just uh, give it a wrench. Hang on. Oh no, why can't I get back up? <laughs> there we go. You give it a wrench and now you can open this door. Um, I'm really sorry if that don't make a lot of sense, but I'm sure you'll figure it out. If I manage to, you'll be fine. So now, we head up here and see what's in store. Oh, we're on the other side of the gate. We didn't open it though. Good, she was rude. Oh, hey. Don't mind me, I'm nobody. Hello nobody, how are you? We're Robin. Hey, do you think you could kind of leave me alone for a bit? Sorry. No, not at all dude. If you need some alone time, I can respect that. Just fine. In fact, I empathise with you. Mother says the large moon is going through rebirth, and that is a good thing. Well, Mother is full of shit, I imagine. Oh, we've seen you around before. Hey, wait a sec. That is not a City One regulation mechanics jacket. You got here by sneaking on the train for mechanics uh, who helped the settlement people, didn't you? So did I. Oh, how's it going, bro? I have no idea what this huge heater thing is. I live in the bush over there, but that bush is cleaner than the settlement I come from. I'll make my way up eventually. You just make sure to find a blue jacket instead of that red one. Right, so we need a blue jacket and then we can fit in. What's this bush like? Hey, it looks, does look pretty good, to be fair. Do you, do you uh, cut that yourself? Keep it trimmed? What about you, lady? 
I miss my friend Star. We'd play a lot as kids, but since then she just stays inside. She says she doesn't need to go outside, that she has people to talk to anyway. I don't know. I want to talk to her face. Even though she has online friends, she's probably involved in like a kick-ass Discord server, so she don't have to leave the house. Did you attend the ceremony for the new Ivory Reborn? They look so amazing, especially Noble. Praise the try. Well, um, those agents look kind of gross and sick to me every time. Shush, be quiet. It's not for us to judge how he presents them to us. Besides, their appearance strikes fear into sinners. So it's a little bit of unrest. They've got to pretend everything's hunky-dory, but I don't think it is. And you again. Why is it just rehashes of the same NPCs? It's confusing me. I've never left this city. It seems cold out there. Unless they're all clones of each other. Okay, now you again. I can't go to that awful job again today. Oh my god, she's literally me. I should volunteer for the Transcender Ivory Bath. I don't care about dying. I'd die of something greater than what I am in life. There has to be more to my soul than spending days pushing papers. Please, stop hitting so close to home. <laughs> I don't want to go to work tomorrow. Anyway, you? Oh, you're saying nothing. Okay. Man, the stuff you recommended me got rid of the, ac of the ache. <laughs> I thought you said acne. But now I feel sick. Oh, I knew that could happen. There's some other stuff for that. Shit, is he peddling him drugs? Why does it seem like nobody other than me is worrying about these weird small quakes we've been getting recently? I've noticed them. We're, we're supposed to be safe from penance here in City 1, right? We're supposed to be put on trial and outcast instead, right? I guess so, if that gives you solace. Oh, we need a key for the lock. Let's go get it. Um, we know what to do with you. Perfect. And down here, oh fucking bollocks. That's it, come along. Oh, okay. Run! Oh my god, what a shot. What do I do with this? Will it be electrocuted? No, I don't. Oh, we got the key. It's incredibly easy. Oh, we'll take the damage. What's the worst that could happen? Obviously, we die. Oh, no, we missed it. Shit, shit, shit. Alright, well, we're gonna survive. That was a lot easier than I was expecting. I'm so ungrateful. But we do need to get out of here, actually. Oh, no. I think the jump is throwing it off. That's it. You don't need to jump. Well, the height seems like it's not correct. But it obviously is. Okay, open up. That's good. We've got some tweakness back. Do some health, like a save point or something. There we go. Ask and it shall provide. I think that's a, a biblical thing. Um, City 1, save it. Good shit. Full health. And the statue's help as well with our tweakness. I'll try to have Mother bless my fortunes. Uh, hey, is that Mother's parade float? Was it a holiday today? I need to see her. Oh my almighty, can I see mother today? Play your cards right, perhaps. By the try, it's mother. Let's do it again. Oh, I'm feeling faint. Go back to your bush. Mother. <laughs> Let me see your beauty, mother. Mother, bless me. Did you sneeze? I'm, I'm so close. Wait, we still on about the parade? Look at it gushing out there. That's horrible. Oh my god, it's so phallic. There's mother. Mother. Royal? You are appearing to the people on a common day? Were we not told he was held captive, Mother? Dear Mother, those are the aggressors with him. Please keep your demeanour, Mother. We can't risk an upset. Mother? My son, I am glad to see you here in City One again. As you can see, I am displaying myself to my other beloved children and listening to their plights. We must talk later. But it is a common day. Royal, listen to Mother. I must finish my tour. Mother, these are the people who have caused all this turmoil. We Hush, child. There is nothing wrong. No need to speak. Mother, the one concerned has gone mad. They imprisoned me, and only with the help of these people have I been able to return. Oh, how good of your friends. But do calm down and be silent. No need for these things to be said here, my son. What? Did you not hear what I said, mother? The agents are disrespectful heathens and they need to be dealt with. Now, son, I brought these people with me, this man Elro. I feel he deserves your healing. The least we can do is absolve him of his sin. Wait, absolve him of his sin? Is that what you meant? What do you mean, all? It is almost unheard of. Elro will be able to resume life with a clean conscience. 
Mother always makes it better. Wasn't your magical mother going to Healy's arm or something? What? No, I don't think mother can do that. Maybe if he was pulling the transcender, but he would never choose him. I don't give a crap about your brand of sin, and I, I doubt these two do either. We've gone through a lot, Royal. We've travelled a hundred horizons, left people behind, and killed agents. Now, listen. Do not tell such lies here. I'll have these guards take you to the bastion where we will discuss things in private. You wish they were lies. Our seeds are the truth. Do not speak like this to Mother. Enough. You will get out of our way, or we will just run you over. M mother Don't you call me that. You are no son to me. You, along with your friends, are the reason for it all coming apart. M mother please. But you, Royal, most of all, it is you. We are always caught up in the middle of this shit. <laughs> Another family feud. Do you wonder about these quakes? It is the death knell for the world. The crust is dry because of us and the pirates. And now you call upon him, the star worm, through your idiocy? Everything's ruined. Your friends ruined all we had prepared for the future. Royal, you have destroyed humanity. Stop saying that. How could I have done that? Now we're going to have to answer to him without excuses. Why do we need excuses? You never stopped being a dumb child, so why would we ever include you? We, we had a hope. Now there is none. I will go to that rocket. You will stay here and die. Oh, I will not be torn asunder by his wrath. I, I'm more than that. What even are you? You're a person like the rest of us. <laughs> Royal is nothing. No matter what's been done, I was still chosen by him. Fine. If you want to stand in front of me, I will show you how the divine push back. Enough! Take refuge, my children. Wait, we're about to fight, mother? Oh, Lord Jesus. Let's bring her down a peg or two. Shit, did she fuck up her own name? Oh my god, it's a stone panther thing. I am the mother of the earth. You have challenged the very ground you walk on. Alright, let's get it. It's only me. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, do we hit the rocks? And then what? I'm not even doing any damage yet. Oh, look at this. Okay, this is how we dodge then. And um, what do we do? Come on, think. Think, Robin. I'm trying to think, has it got something? Oh, you can hit its open mouth. Okay. Man, that didn't do any damage though. We're so dead, and I have no idea what to do. Alright, so you wrench it. Get down here, mother. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> do, we, do you think we need to swap the uh, swap places with mother when she's knocked out like that? I have no idea what's going on. Nope, okay, we're dead. That is not surprising in the slightest. Once I figure out what the fuck we have to do, we may have a better chance. Oh, okay, that's what you do. Right. So, when the cat's down, you swap places with Mother. You bring her down to Earth, and then you try and kick her ass. I really don't know how to dodge damage from this damn cat. Oh, Royal, what are you doing? Okay, let's just shoot that rock. I don't know if that's doing anything. Yes, that did a whole lot of good, I think. That doesn't look good. Shit, we really need to time our jumps over the damn cat a lot better. It's so hard to dodge damage because of this thing. Oh crap, get over! Nope. <laughs> oh, we need that health. Yes, good shit. Open your mouth, kitty. Let's jam some bullets in there. Yes, yes, that's good. Alright, she's down again. Go! That's it, good shit, Mina. I don't know if we're going to survive, though. I need to dodge, like, one... Oh, shit. I need to dodge at least one attack. Come on, come on, get out of here, rock. Fuck you, fuck you. Not you, Dwayne Johnson. Oh, I knew that attack, but still wasn't able to dodge it. We've got half health. We may be all right. Depends when it opens its mouth. Yes. That's beautiful. We dodged something. I'm so proud of ourselves. Shit. Stop chasing me. Go for it. Oh, nice. We've got the timing down a little bit better. And we got some health back. Get quietly confident. Right, this is what we need. 
Go, 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 go. And bring her down. Hit her, hit her. Yes. Oh, one more should do it, I think, right? Oh, fuck. Health's bad. Go, 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 go. Everyone, give it everything you got. Destroy it. Yes. Now what? Oh, fuck. No, this can't be the end. We need to do our best here, our utmost best. Now, if the cat charges, we may be able to dodge it. Oh, no, not a new attack. Why'd you do a new attack now? Where the fuck is it? There it is. Come on, come on. Not again. We're dead. We're dead. <laughs> we can survive one more hit. Oh, help! Go, 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 go! Destroy it! Fucking no! Come on, last time. Get it, get it, get it! Right, take her out, take her out. I think we've done it this time. I'm not sure. Oh no, yes, is she down? Thank fuck. What a tough fight that was. Go to hell, mother. I feel perfectly fine saying that. Oh, God. Oh, she convulsed in? she going to throw up? Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> mother. Get away from me. Oh, what's happening to me? Oh. Oh. I, I can't heal. Oh, she's going to explode. L Lord, please. What did you do to Mother? We we defended ourselves. Please don't die, Mother. I'm sorry. Mother doesn't die. Just incredible. Who the hell's that? Oh, it's him, Agent Chrome. I thought you had your face caved in. You! You and your soldiers are not permitted in this city. How did you enter? Well, we're going to have to find out next episode, because believe it or not, this is where we're going to leave it. I don't know if that's poor timing on my part, or maybe just uh, trying to get interested in the next one. Who knows? But we defeated Mother. Look at her there, all swollen and coughing and puking. It's uh, kind of horrible, actually. But if you enjoyed this episode of Iconoclast, please go ahead and leave a like. It helps out a great deal. I really do appreciate it. If you want to see more, we're going to carry on this conversation from the point we're at and see what exactly is going to happen from here. We're kind of in a bad spot, if you ask me. But please go ahead and subscribe. I can bring that to you. Got any questions you want to raise? How did you feel about that weird fight? Look at that statue behind me. It really creeps me out. But please let me know in the comments below, and I'll make sure I get back to you. All right? See you.